through the eyes of a traveler. Hello world, welcome back. So, what's the plan of action today, you might ask? And, it's a good question. So, for starters, shall we say we're going to take some twisty roads. For the main course, we're going to visit a place called Sajigod Waterfall. Now, we're not going to Sajigod straight away. There is another waterfall there, called the Umbrella Waterfall. A little hidden, a little off the beaten track. But that's the one I'm going to first. And then for dessert, we'll finish off with the more well-known Sajikot waterfall. I hope you enjoy. Sit back, relax, and uh, enjoy the view. Do please, please, comment, like, and if you haven't already subscribed, please do consider subscribing. Subscriptions are so much encouragement. And... Uh, when you're riding as long as I am, and uh, the distances that I do, you need all the encouragement you can get. Anyway, thank you in advance. Hello world, so I'm heading towards something called the Umbrella Waterfall but prior to that you see this cascade and then this rapid infested stream or river whatever you want to call it um, and then I'll show you the, uh, the Umbrella Waterfall most people know this area for a waterfall called Sajikot Waterfall which I've been told is not as impressive as this but rarely do people come this way because they stay on the path this is a little tough it's arduous um, that's the path we just walked up it's about I mean told it's half a kilometer but it's literally 45 to 60 degrees incline so it's not easy but hopefully when we get to the bottom we'll see the splendor of the umbrella waterfall I think I can see a glimpse of it so let me reconnect when we get to the bottom so this is umbrella waterfall I think it's given the name Umbrella because it's moss has grown over to create an umbrella effect and therefore the name sticks, Umbrella Waterfall. I'm not sure if you can hear me over the sound of the water but it's fast flowing.
I'm no master at flying the drone, but I wanted to fly the drone through the canyon. It's a very narrow canyon, not an easy task, so I apologize for the jerky nature of the recording, but we did go right to the end as far as we could anyway. I hope you enjoy. I'm making this video on the pretense it's a beautiful shot and it is but the truth is I'm out of breath and I've only walked from there to here probably 150 meters but it's a steep incline so slow and steady remember the story of the hare and the tortoise here they say Hargosh or Kachwa I'm definitely the Kachwa <laughs> तो आप अपना ही तारफ कराएं। सावलीकुम सर, मेरा नाम सकलेन जुलुकार है और बेसिकली मैं यहाँ कहीं हूँ। ये अमरेला वटरफॉल है, ये अल्लाह ताला की तरफ से हमें एक नेमत मिली है। तो यहाँ पे आएं, जहाँ के सम का दावन अब आप से करेंगे, जो भी हमसे हुआ, ना के यहाँ पे फैमिली सिक्योर है, इन्शाल्लाह टूर्स वगैरह भी आते हैं लाहौर से आए हैं लोग कराची से बहुत ज़्यादा लोग आए हैं गवादर से आए हैं बहुत मसन को ऐसी जगह है कि कल से एक स्विट्जरलैंड से एक फैमिली आई है जो ये जगह देख के गई है उन्होंने कहा कि स्विट्जरलैंड भी हमने देखा है और पाकिस्तान की तो बात ही कुछ और है जबरदस्त Shall we go for a ride? That's a yes from you and a yes from me. <laughs> the span of the cable car is around 300 meters, maybe a little more. That's the landslide, the earthquake created. And over there, can't really see very clearly his umbrella waterfall. So, another look at the uh, devastation of the earthquake. And uh, 
another look at this sturdy cable car. It doesn't look very sturdy, but it is safe. Well, that's what they told me anyway. <laughs> The young guy that I introduced earlier, Sakling, runs this uh, restaurant with his brother. It's a great place for family or larger gatherings and you have great views just past the small bazaar. Speaking of the small bazaar, this is where I actually parked my motorcycle. And uh, there's a couple of shops, everything you want you can get. And this little restaurant, is where I stayed the night. This kind soul asked if I would stay the night here and the price, just my company. What a great person. You meet wonderful people en route for sure. Hello world and welcome back. So uh, I stayed the night at a place which is known for a waterfall called Umbrella Waterfall. I had a wonderful time, sat with the locals, stayed in a makeshift hotel. Uh, it wasn't a hotel per se, it was a restaurant, but the restaurant uh, was so kind, he suggested that I stay with him the night. And You know, um, sometimes when I travel, I don't stay in hotels, I stay in places where locals invite me and uh, I know I'm going to get a, a great experience, um, I'm going to hear local stories, I'm going to regale some of my stories of travel and uh, a level of respect gets built um, which um, I, I can't really put a, a, a price on it, it just is priceless. But before I continue my long long journey all the way to the Chinese border I have to show you Saji Court, the more well-known, famous waterfall of this area. And there you have it. That is Saji Court. It's a beautiful, picturesque, wonderful waterfall. So thank you for staying with me on my journey. Time to hit the road and hit it hard. Long, long track ahead. But I hope you enjoy the views. And for now, I sign off. Take care everyone. For those that ride, please ride safely. And until next time, have a great life. Oh, lest I forget, don't forget to subscribe, comment and like. Bye-bye. <laughs>